The Victorian Liberal leader, John Pesuto, has faced a frosty reception from delegates at the party state council meeting. Several members walked out while others heckled as, the, as he took the stage. Hollywood Smith is in Bendigo for the meeting. Holly, can you talk us through what happened? Well, Jamie, this action wasn't necessarily unexpected. There had been whispers that some rank-and-file members would today walk out to, in protest of the Liberal leader, John Pesuto, specifically around his handling of Upper House MP Moira Deeming. So today, as John Pesuto took the stage, he was met with some applause and a standing ovation from some members. But there was about a dozen or so that decided to walk out before he began his inaugural speech at the State Council as leader. There was also some members who had brought masked cutouts of Moira Deeming and began yelling shame and even booing the Liberal leader. Thank you very much. Order, order. Janie, speaking with some of these rank-and-file members after they walked out of John Pesuto's speech, much of their reasoning is specifically around his handling of Upper House MP Moira Deeming. She represents the Western Metropolitan Region here in Victoria, and she attended a Let Women Speak rally earlier this year that was then interrupted by a group of neo-Nazis. This has led uh, to a range of events. She was attempted to be expelled from the party earlier this year, but was instead suspended. But after threatening legal action and uh, against John Pesuto for claims of defamation, she was then expelled from the party this month. And this has led to quite a rift between Liberal Party members. Now, some of the constituents today who walked out were actually uh, constituents of that Western Metropolitan Region who elected Moira Deeming to represent them. Moira was our elected Member of Parliament and we've only ever had one member. This year she's managed to get two up. We haven't um, had that sort of success for a long time. She knows the West, she looks after us, and I think she's been treated appallingly. At the very least, be given the benefit of the doubt. Yes. At the very least, investigate. Find out what happened. And understand what had actually occurred prior to jumping to those conclusions absolutely. and then just defaming her the way he did was absolutely disgraceful. Yes. Janie, despite this disturbance and the walkout from some members, John Pesuto is confident in his ability to lead the Liberal Party and reform the party. He hopes to win new seats at the next state election and change how Victorians see the Liberal Party. He wants to form a strong opposition against Daniel Andrews and he says that he was focused today on the people that support him. Uh, I was very moved by the two standing ovations that uh, occurred during my speech at the start and at the end. If there were people who had different views, that's a matter for them, but what I saw was a strong endorsement of my commitment to reforming the party. The focus for Mr Basuto at this State Council will be looking at tax reform. Again, despite his confidence and his ability to leave, there are certainly some rank-and-file members who are not happy with his handling of Upper House MP Moira Deeming. Holly Edward-Smith, live in Melbourne. Thank you very much for the update.